Hey guys, it's Eric Roberts from Worship the King, and today we're getting into an intermediate to advanced lesson. I'm gonna show you some of the really cool things I did on Echo Cover. The links are in the description, and I'm gonna be showing you all the patterns and strumming and the lick and riff. You can get the tabs on the free chord chart in the description of this video. Also, make sure you like, share, and subscribe, and make a comment. Just make any good old comment down there so I know you're listening and know you're watching. So this is how I started out. Um, in, in part of my cover. I went Okay, I started out like this. I also went But I want to work on the rhythm, that rhythm right there. It goes one, two, and then. So I went like, when night is falling, when fear is coming, still you're calling me. Now, I'm not saying that if you're a beginner, it's gonna be really, it's gonna be super hard to play and sing this. So that's just gonna take time, but I wanna show you the rhythm, and that's what I'm doing right here. We're gonna break this down in terms of what I'm really doing. So let's count it out loud. If you can't say it, then you can't play it. It goes one, two, and a, and a four, and a one, Two and a e and a four and a one two and a e and a four and a one two and a e and a four and a. That's how it sounds. Uh, let's see if I can do it in ta's and t's and tickas. It goes like ta t ticka t ticka ta t. So it goes ta t ticka t ticka. It's hard to do this because there's a break on three. That's that's three. One two and a e and a four and a one. Two and a three and a, so it's three and a. Three is silent. One, it doesn't have to be. In another version of this, I have three not being silent, and you can see that you could just go one, two and a three and a four and a one, two and a three and a four and a one, two and a three and a four. But if we take out the three, it creates a really cool sort of, I don't know, tension or something like. One, two, and a t e and a four, and a one, two, and a t e and a four, and a one, two, and a e and a four, and a. Okay, this is much easier to count with twos and fours and e andas than to say ta, t, ticka, ikka, because it doesn't have a ticka, it has a ikka, ikka, t, ticka. That's what it would be. It would be ta, t, ticka. Ikka t ticka. So let's just keep it with the numbers and we're going to make sure you can download this from the website so you have it. But it's gonna go like this. Um, one, two, and a, e and a four, and a one, two, and a, e and a four, and a one, two, and a, e and a four, and a one, two, and a, e and a four, okay? So I'm gonna break it down really slow. But if you can do ta, if you can do one, Two and a e and a four and a one, two and a e and a four. Now I was stomping on the ground, but I think it shakes the camera, so I'll just put my guitar down. You can also do this: one, two and a e and a four and a one, two and a e and a four and a one, two and a e and a four and a one, two and a e and a four and a one. Two and a e and a four and a one, two and a e and a four and a one, and that is the chant. We'll do the down up so you can kind of see how it goes. But your hand is always going to be going like this the whole time. One, it goes one, two and a e and a four and a one, two and a. So it does stop on the one, two. We kind of give one, two and a e and a four and a one. Two and a e and a four and a one two and a e and a four and a. So you kind of let your pick jump over the three. So there is no three. So on that first down on three, you sort of let your pick jump over the strings. You don't touch the strings. So you go one two and a e and a four and a one two and a e and a four and a one two and 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 I don't want to mislead you. 
because a lot of people will try this pattern and here's the, the common pitfall of strumming and, and the root of many problems in strumming is you hear the rhythm and so you go like this. One, two, and a, three, and a, four, and a, one, two, and a. So you try to move your hand in the rhythm that you hear and that is, that is clearly not gonna work. What works is moving your hand in an eighth note pattern like this. Now, if you do an accent like on a one, you go one, two, but you notice my hand's still kind of moving. One, two, okay, one, two, and a, E, and a four, and a one, two. See, my hand is going like this the whole time. So I really sort of go like one, two, one, two, and a, E, and a four, and a one, two. You see, so my hand is going like this the whole time. So if you can move your hand up and down like this and say tick a 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 one two and a e and a four and a one two and a e and a four and a one are you still with me? I don't know. I don't know how many people are gonna stay on this video. I'm six minutes in and I'm not sure like at what minute you were like my brain exploded and I just shut the video off and went and watched, you know, some kayaking videos. I, that's, that, I don't know, but if you're still here, congratulations. Download this chart because if you can say and play this like I just did, and if you can take your hand and you can just go like this, then you can actually go like this is what I did in the verse. I went, one, when night is falling, and fear is coming, Still you're calling me When faith is lost and not exhausted Still you be my strength See ah, bah, bah, ah, ah. So it is such a cool pattern That is so cool and you can do it in different ways If you're still here I'm gonna show you like three or four different ways you can do this And I did this on my cover I went When night is falling be exhausted Still you're calling me My faith is lost And my hope exhausted See I'm kind of doing it kind of soft I, I'm throwing in this little Which I'm going to show you in another video But I'm using my fingers I'm kind of going I'm kind of going One, two, one, five, two, and five. So you can throw in all kinds of stuff, but you're gonna go back to the pattern. You're gonna do that just like that, so you can do it just like that, or you can do, you know, like just full out like I did. Um, hear that? So all those cool things are in that pattern. So if you're palm muting or sliding or doing whatever, remember the foundation is the key. Knowing the pattern and understanding how the pattern works is the key to sounding awesome. Guys, if you wanna learn more like this, go to worshipthekeng.com, join me, make sure you send a comment, a like, a share, subscribe, and click the bell. So what do you have to do? Just go down there and click the thumbs up. That's the first thing, you just like the video. That's pretty simple to do. Just dink, you did that. And then all you gotta do is go right there where it says subscribe and just hit subscribe, boop. You're done, that's easy. And then uh, let's see, the little bell is there, like dink, the bell, that's easy. So like, share, subscribe. Oh, you can even share it. Now that's a little harder because you gotta get the share button and then decide, no, I don't wanna share this too. But hey, you can still do it if you want to. And then write a comment, right? Dude, I love that. I want more of that. Do that more. Help me learn that. Do whatever you want. Or hey dude, what are you doing with drums in your video? Why are the drums in the video? I don't know. I'm gonna tell that more about that. You can learn more about that on the website. But we're about to do some awesome things with those drums. God bless you guys. Make sure you download the chart and keep watching.